At the beginning of the year, I was gifted this. A PSA 10 Flaffy Character Rare from VMAX Climax. From fellow sheep enthusiasts and first collector 31. Those who follow me on Instagram know that Flaffy is a fave. I really love sheep. This was a great way to start the year working on my master set. This means every artwork in English and Japanese and every version of it. First edition, deck promo, play promo. Everything. I count both energies and trainers as part of these sets, but we're not counting poker cards, tops, meiji, anything else. Let's go! The binder is organized first by art and then by language. First in English and then Japanese. Then by first edition and unlimited. Immediately standing out on the first page is this beautiful Japanese deck promo, not included in the English release of Neo Discovery. Starting on the second page, I like to organize the cards moving across both pages. I start with my regular English, the reverse, and then move on to the Japanese. The E-Series marks the initial split of a first and unlimited edition in Japanese. This also marks the end of separate print runs in English. For the next few sets, my binder will be organized as regular English, reverse English, first edition Japanese, and finally unlimited Japanese. Beginning with Heart Gold and Soul Silver, second Japanese print runs became scarce and some even non-existent. This would continue through the black and white and X and Y eras, up until the Sun and Moon era where we finally lose separate print runs. The Sword and Shield era brought a lot of flappy love. First with Darkness Ablaze, then Chilling Brain and a McDonald's reprint, and finally Evolving Skies, which introduced the Dynamotor Flappy. Dynamotor Flappy received a total of 20 prints across four arts in both English and Japanese. The start of Scarlet and Violet have already shown Flaffy some love as well, with both a base set print and a deck promo. I want to say a big thanks to everyone who has helped me complete this set, and I'm super excited to add to it in the future. Oh brother, this guy stinks!